Hey guys, I am here outside Heartbeat Percussion in Surrey, British Columbia, Canada. We're gonna do a little tour, so why don't you come on in? It's gonna be fun. And this is Noel, he's the man, the myth, the legend behind Heartbeat Percussion. Noel, hey guys. good to see you. Um, so we're gonna do a little tour. So I'm gonna let you oh. do your thing. Oh, take well, us. Well, welcome around. to Heartbeat. <laughs> um, there's the uh, first prototype Heartbeat drum set that we have uh, built our, our line on. So you, you probably see a few prototype kits and symbols around here as we're wandering around. But uh, yeah. yeah. So hey, this way, this is. Uh, oh, we do other stuff as well. We're not just symbol guys. We do cases and all sorts of goodies. This is where we actually record all of our sound files. We shoot some videos. It's a little empty right now, but uh, for example, there's one of our heartbeat kits, a little bebop size. There's actually the uh, the new Anthem series prototypes are sitting on this kit right now. On this wall are some more anthems, and we also have prototypes and demos. And every now and then we do get uh, uh, a symbol that's got a blemish or something on it. So. We have some of those too, and yeah. Well, hey, well let's let's take you into the holy of holies, the, uh, <laughs> the warehouse. <laughs> awesome. So this is this is the place. So we're not a store. We're not. Uh, you know, we wanted this place to be a place where people could come and hang out. So when guys are in checking out their gear, usually the rest of the band is flaked out here, or sleeping, or whatever. Here, there's one of our new maple. Six ply maple RB kits um, with a 20 inch kick. Oh, and uh, a 26 inch jazz ride sitting on it, which is one of our newest creations. Actually, this whole series is the jazz series. Uh, so it looks like 17 inch hats as well. Cool. And And so, the this maple kit does it come in any other sizes, or is this... um, our our focus with heart with the heartbeat drums is 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 really simple. We have them. Uh, we don't make them here. We have them made to our specs. We find just like all our products, we find uh, a manufacturer that we can work with that will build the quality that we want and the product that we want. So we have these kits made for us. Uh, we chose all the specs, the hardware. So the, the kit has, uh, like I said, a six ply maple. It's got die cast hoops. It's got a, a trick USA throw off, snare throw off on it. Um, we do them in 18 inch, 20 inch. We've done some 22 and 24 inch sets, uh, kicks as well. But it's all basically designed for, um, well, where our, our, our focus has always been is working with churches and ministries. You know, we're not out trying to set the world on fire with our kits or, or track down a ton of endorsers. We're here to make a great kit at a, at a great price. And we also are working on hardware. So like the, the stand that the 26 inch ride is on is one of our new cymbal stands. Uh, we're doing everything a little extra heavy duty. Um, you'll even notice the, uh, the throne on the back, which is, has four legs rather than three. So we want it really sturdy. It's vented at the back for a little air circulation. Um, I'm just trying to do everything really good. I'd, if I'm gonna put my name on it, it's gotta be really good. And it's, a, it's always a work in process. Started working on developing the drums a few years ago and we're still working on it. And over there is an ash kit. Ooh. So a six by ash. Uh, didn't put die cast hoops on them, we put uh, a triple flange opens up a little nicer. The snare is a 13 by seven, which sounds great. And here you, here you see some of the different cymbal series. Uh, again, it looks like there's lots of anthems out. Again, it's, it's a new series in the jazz series. There's our redesigned Holy Crash. Uh, we do the 19s and 20s with the extra holes. It makes a little trashier sound. Um, it's our popular custom series. Yeah. That's what you get with handmade symbols is they're not perfectly weighted all the way around and it's one of the things that gives them their individual flavor. Um, our classic series is, is, what, is the first series we started with and then next is the Striped Studio series. Yeah. And there's, oh, there's one of our great vintage series which is uh, 
the one series we have that costs more than the others, it's uh, extra labor intensive, it's dark and dirty and trashy. And... So what is the difference between a vintage symbol and a raw symbol? The difference is the, the raw has a fully laid bell and it's polished. The vintage is not. Uh, the vintage, there's extra labor to get, uh, they actually use a different hammer uh, for it and the gray finish, it's, um, it's a bit trashier and drier. Uh, and the raw is, has a little bit bigger bell and it's, it's similar, but it's, it's different enough. I think we have 11 series now um, and I tell people, it's like, once, once you decide you want a heartbeat, it's like, once you've chosen the car that you want to buy, I've got 11 colors to choose from. Yeah. So they all work, they're all in the same range, they all mix well together. Um, it's just like, what, what color sound do you want?